The new Filmora 12.5 introduces an exciting new feature called Audio Driven Effects. This tool enhances the editing experience by allowing users to easily create visually captivating effects that are synchronized with the audio in their videos. Audio Driven Effects leverage the power of audio analysis to automatically generate visual effects that are perfectly in sync with beats, rhythm, or intensity of the audio track. By analyzing the audio waveform, frequency spectrum, or other audio attributes, Filmora 12.5 intelligently detects key audio events and translates them into visually stunning effects. With these 10 new effects, users can effortlessly add dynamic and engaging visuals to their videos without the need for manual keyframing or intricate adjustments. Filmora 12.5 provides a range of preset effects that are specifically designed to complement different audio characteristics. These effects can include RGB pulsating lights, glitches, flashing colors, text animations, zoom in and zoom out, and many more. To access these 10 new audio-driven effects, you just have to import your video first. So I already have here a video that I got from the stock media of Filmora 12.5. You can get more by searching here. You just have to go to Pexels or Pixabay, then search any video file or type of video that you want. For example, this party right here, like that. And of course, since these are audio driven effects, you will need to have an audio for your video or a separate audio that you will use as your background music, such as this one. Yeah. Alright, so I'm sorry if that was loud, but this is a sample so that you can see the effects clearly when I applied it, okay? Now that you have your audio and video, you just have to go to effects and scroll down to audio effects right here, and you will see these audio driven effects. These are 10 new effects that Filmora added on their new update. So that's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So we have audio driven color shift, glitch, glitch 1, glitch 2, flashing white light, audio driven blur, audio driven exposure, audio driven glitch, saturation, audio driven zoom, and audio driven flash black. We will try this one, Audio Driven Zoom. To use this, you just have to drag and drop it on top of your video, another layer of course, to take effect. And then, if you want to make it longer, I just have to drag it to the end of your video clip. Originally, this clip looks like this. Yeah. So let me apply the Audio Driven Zoom on this clip. And let's see what's going to happen. Yeah. As you can see, it's now zooming in and zooming out. And the zoom in and zoom out is in sync with the beats of the audio that I have here on my editing timeline. Now, if you want to improve the effect, you can adjust the threshold, minimum threshold and maximum threshold of the audio driven zoom. Yeah. Alright, let's now try the other audio driven effects. Audio driven glitch. Let's see what's gonna happen with this. Yeah. Alright, so as you can see, when the audio that I have here faded out, the audio driven glitch has now no effects. See? But as you can see on this part right here, when the bass is dropping and there's so much sound, the effect is in sync with these beats. Alright, so that is it for this video. I hope you like this one. If you do, Please hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Peace out.